Welcome to the Vozik Podcast, video number 7. We're going to take a look at the presets folder. At the bottom, we have the user presets. So we have here some presets from several contributions from other users. And also there is the feature showcase folder. Here you can take a look at some of the features that the Vozik engine has. For instance, let's take a look at the amplitude modulation. So you can see here they have on layer 1 a sawtooth waveform and on layer 2 we have a sine waveform and layer 1 has volume while the layer 2 doesn't have any volume so we're using actually the output of layer 2 to modulate layer 1 you can see here out 2 and amplitude 1 so if I change the tuning of the second layer is going to affect the amplitude of the first layer. I can also f make the pitch fixed. can also take a look at the other options here from the feature showcase complex repagiator where I'm using here the wave sequencer repagiator which I'm going to discuss in another video in more detail we have some other options here, beach crusher the grade is an effect envelope type is delay You can notice that the, the modulation envelope one is going to the pitch of the, os the layer 2. You can also call it oscillator 2. And you can also notice the modu envelope, modulation envelope type is changing here. So if I change it to a linear, it changes the pitch right away. But if I change to an exponential one, actually an inverted exponential so we have here is an exponential one two inverted one two and four there are other options like granular lo-fi key switching layers crossfade lfo to sequence start of the wave sequencer have load several waveforms and set the waveforms here on the wave sequencer and an LFO it changing the wave sequencer start step phase position this is kind of lo-fi FM because I'm using a sample I'm using a regular, regular sample and just changing the phase position of the sample there are several other options in the feature showcase here I'm using a gate on the wave sequencer when I set gate here the volume changes are instant so we can ha make some pretty good gate sounds with the wave sequencer and there are other several options so that's it for this video thank you